Hi everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Lori and today I am going to be unboxing the Lurella Cosmetics and this is something that is very new for me. I found them as I came across one of the ads on social media. It was Instagram and a lot of times that's where I'm finding beauty box subscriptions or I will find different cosmetic companies that have mystery boxes, bundles, such as, you know, I was already getting Lip Monthly, had no idea that they had a Lip Monthly bundle for $30 a month. Anyhow, the Lorella has mystery boxes and I ordered the one and two. I think it was the one and two. If not, I'm going to go ahead and put the information down in the description box below anyhow, just to make sure that I have that information right along with the prices, but there's different tiers. There are three different tiers and there's the lower rate one and then the middle of the road. And then of course you have your higher. So this one here does not seem like it weighs very much. So my guess is this is the, um, lesser of the two that I purchased and they came just today. What I do like about them is that the big box that these two were in, this is really heavy. I mean, really heavy. It gives FabFitFun a run for its money and weight, but they have this on there and I absolutely love this because this is what protects these products that are inside from being shuffled around during shipping and going from one different carrier to the next until they get to our doorstep. So, with all that said, let's dive into the small one, okay? Well, well, well. The Lurella family. Not bad, huh? They do have a lot of the crinkle paper in here. And then I see some paper that has their name on it. And really pretty, it looks like rose gold. Okay, hang on here a sec. Okay, without making a big mess, taking this stuff out. Oh Lord, how am I gonna do this without making a big old mess? Okay, we're just gonna take this out and set it down, okay? Bear with me here. All right, so now you can see that it does have the tissue paper and the little sticker. So, rip it doesn't matter. Okay, okay, okay. All right, you guys, like I do, you guys see it before me. I was trying to make sure nothing falls out. What's in there? Come on, I'm trying to peek around here too. I think I see a palette. Possibly, possibly. Lip product. Okay, don't know how many items are in here. Oh, you're not gonna believe this. There is not necessarily a pack in slip, something of the sort. Okay, eight, okay, because th now this I did notice on the website. It says here, and this is what they give us, okay? The different variations. And up here it says 80 people will get iconic, Ultra gloss, liquid eyeshadow, highlighter, free shipping, and it's going to total $59. So, and I was right. Okay. I'm going to fold this because the top half has my address on it, but I was right. I did get mystery box number one and number two. Okay. Awesome. Awesome. So here's the one thing that it says. Okay, how many people are going to get Iconic? 16. How many get Ultra Gloss? 10. Liquid Eyeshadow? 12. Highlighter? 14. And seven of us get free shipping. So, no, I totally read that wrong. Those are the prices. <laughs> oh my God. Sometimes I need to have this box open, look through it, and then I can tell you guys what's in it and probably explain a lot more, do a little bit more research and just have this information correctly instead of incorrectly. 
anyhow, that's the value. Okay, so the total box is, an, in, so what it's saying, 80 people get it, $59 worth of stuff. So each of these boxes was its own price, and I can't remember the amount that I actually did pay. It doesn't matter. That wasn't a lot, I can tell you that much. It's going to be in the description box down below. So, iconic. Like I said, maybe I should have went ahead and opened it. It's an eyeshadow palette, I think. Yes, it is. And I hope, can you see these? It's different kinds of these different shades. Try not to get that glare there for you. But it has uh, 10 pans. And you're not going to believe this, but it's like, seriously, we are going through so much time opening these darn packages. And right now, and I apologize, I am going to probably spend the next couple days reviewing and practicing an editing program that my husband has made. I think the decision on which one we're going to go with. There are two video editor, uh, you know, the software that's what he does for a living, so not editing. He's a software engineer. So, the, wow, imagine that. We got into something without having to spend an entire time on packaging. Favorite part, protective sleeve, and our six. There is no mirror, but there are the six pans. Very pretty colors. Very pretty colors. Some of the names are Empire, Vivid, Epic, Goodnight, Fearless, Rebel, Next Level, Legendary. Vi you know, I mean, those are some pretty cool, pretty cool names. Anyhow, you have nine pans for this eyeshadow. And I really do like the name. They did, looks like they did it for Morella. All right, next on the list we have, again, where are my scissors or an X-Acto knife when you need it? This is going to be a lip gloss, and it does say Ultra Gloss. Yes, Ultra Gloss for Lorella, and it's not saying any name. Single. If you're single and you know it, clap your hands. <laughs> Sorry, it's late. My husband's giving me a little bit of time to do a couple of videos before he needs to come in here and get to bed. Okay, look at, I love this, this is glass. And it has their name on it. It's almost like a bronze, isn't it? It's like a copper, but it's like I said before, if I go ahead and open it up and I do a swatch, it might, Just look exactly like my skin. Wow. And the only reason why I'm starting to be very cautious and careful about doing swatches on the back of my hand. See, look at that. See? It's basically almost the color. If I look at it in certain light, it's basically the color of my skin, only with a little bit of glitter. So, um... The reason why I'm a little careful, like I said, cautious about doing swatches on the back of my hand uh, is that a couple of products recently were stuck on my hand for long periods of time. I mean, it was until the next day, even after recording my, the video and getting cleaned up, showered, and nothing was taking it off. I was scrubbing and making my skin raw. And so I said, you know what? There are some serious lip stains out there. And it's not necessarily that it says lip stain as much as it's that the lip product is designed to stay on your lips, you know, with no touch-ups during the day and no needing to go to the mirror and pull your, you know, your product out of your desk and touch up before lunch. No, this, I'm talking a lot of products that are stain. So this next one is a liquid eyeshadow. The one before that, this one's $10 and the eyeshadow palette was 16. Okay. 
And this one is liquid eyeshadow or a highlighter. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh, pretty. Look at this. That's gorgeous. You know what? My favorite, those little air bubbles. Oh, can't wait until it gets some air in there. And pop. There it is. Yep. This packaging is gorgeous. This, it's absolutely beautiful. Lorella, you did a fantastic job, you know, getting your products together. And then... Sorry to say this, it's becoming just crazy getting into this. I mean, you you seriously, I mean, okay, guys, this is a highlighter. I don't have any way right here with me. I don't have things, things scissors. I have no Sacto knife. And something that won't make so much noise. Wow, crazy. No, this is nuts. This is too much. I mean, I will tell you right now that they're doing what a lot of other companies should do. And that is protect their products. The shipping that these things go through and the amount of uh, like brute force. I mean, these guys working on warehouses, they don't care. They're tossing this like it's a basketball and we get our products and it's things are shattered they're I mean like the eyeshadow pans and stuff like that I'm not even gonna open that that's just too much packaging for me so I'll show that to you in another video okay and what I think I might do is finish the, the product that's all bundled up I'm going to split this video into two videos so that it's part one and part two of unboxing for Lorella Cosmetics. And I'm going to go get a pair of scissors, open this up, show you that in the beginning, and then move on to the box that has the large weight. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Stay tuned, though, and then up, I'm going to upload the other one at the same time. So go ahead and click on part two and watch the unboxing of the second box from Lorella Cosmetics, okay? Give it a thumbs up, hit your subscribe button, turn on your notifications so you know when the next video uploads, and it's going to be part two. So it's going to be good. I think it's going to be good, and I'm going to get a pair of scissors so I can cut through all that excessive, I, well, no, not excessive. We need this stuff, okay? The packaging that's inside these beauty products, these, the boxes. So you guys have a wonderful evening. Okay. And even though I know it is getting late, we're still going to try to get box number two done. I don't know, but stay tuned. God bless. Have a good evening.